Hello everybody, welcome back to Carrots Gaming, I'm your host Carrots, you're back at it again with some more Empire or playing the amazing mod Awakening of the Rebellion. Playing as the- ha! There we go. Hang on a second, let me finish the introduction. Playing as the Alliance to Restore the Republic. So, this is recorded directly after the last episode, like I literally stopped recording the post recording again. So, this is the fleet we're retreating to give this fleet support because I made a dumb mistake and I got the entire Mon Cala fleet except the capital ship and one corvette killed. <laughs> Might have been my fault, but you know, I'm blaming tactical interference. They they messed with my comms. That's the the my, the head cannon. That's what happened. They like messed with my comms and made me underestimate my thing. That arm just stupid. <laughs> I've actually never really looked at this ship in much detail. It looks pretty. Like, it does look pretty. Does it have... Anywho. Yes, sir. If I kind of look... Do these got a new model, too? I don't know. A lot of new things change. I actually went back and looked at the change notes. There's also a new Imperial unit that you can only get in starting forces and uh, missions, which is called the Navy Trooper, I guess, which is like kind of like a tier two support trooper for the, the Empire, but they just don't get a lot of them. There's also a space unit that I saw. There's also well, there's a new capital ship. That's right, the Huts have a new capital ship. Apparently, some, I guess, a long range, maybe? I don't actually know what it is. I assume it's the remake one, because I've seen people in, in thumbnails of videos I watch and stuff, of like, big long ship that you didn't see in remake. The hut ship that just looks like a basically a mosquito head. I don't know if I'm describing it well. I wonder if you can actually see it here in any of these fleets now. But I assume it's like an artillery capital ship. Which kind of fills the role. Because I don't think... I really don't think they, the Black Sun have much artillery. Besides the Munificent. And they don't for the Huts, I know that. Alright, so that's going to be here. This force hasn't changed much. Which I don't like. We're gonna get Constructing unit. a bunch of those. Unit canceled. Maybe three of those. Unit in production. Uh, we have ground defenses, that's good. Uh, the reason I didn't spend all that much money is... Oh, I was gonna do this, but that seems super dumb now. I was gonna put another one on, but that would make me completely broke. With only like 200 bucks to deal with stuff, which... I like to have some money to respond to things and situations. Okay. All right. I kind of jumped at that. That didn't change much except for the big screening ship went away. This is very takeable. What do I have? Yeah. Huh. Ah. They might honestly run. Let's get a couple of these built. Oh, that's gonna take agonizing. Let's not. Let's capitalize. We have picket ships. That's all we need. This might be another dis- I, I don't see this fleet taking out a capital ship or most of my fleet again. This is an incredibly weak fleet. It only has three corvettes in it. Four corvettes. We have pickets that are designed to take those out. This should be easy battle. Tactical battle. I hope. Oh no. I didn't put a fleet lead. I swore I put a fleet lead. I guess it doesn't matter much. Reporting. This makes this a tiny Let's bit go. harder. Keep going. We're gonna let them come to us. This way. Get Ready behind report. this, please. You're no use to us as a frontline ship. Come, come on. Give me the... They're falling back. <gasps> Yay, we don't have to do any of this. They're running. That's good. 
bringing out this capital ship probably did that. <sighs> okay. That's one stressor gone. That's a fleet out of our territory. Not a greatest battle ever, the first one. And I realize I made a lot of mistakes in that fight. Like, probably a lot. Like, committing to the fight in the first place when I had a core defense support fleet. I'm like super lucky I was able to save the, ca the capital ship. Because I ha I know the capability of those corvettes that shoot the torpedoes. I know the capabilities of those. And I know that because I've used them to take out ISDs before. Just having a squad of four of them in the back can take out an ISD. I would be terrified to know what they could do. We actually have this. They're building up that. That's pretty good. Let's get a couple more X-Wings. And by a couple, I mean a couple. And then let's put the rest of the credits into this. Yeah, because I'm not worried about them taking it on the ground. Or in the air, I mean. I don't want to commit to a fight because I don't actually know if they have anything on the ground. I'm going to just assume that they don't, because if I hover over it, it just shows it blank. This one's going to be a tough battle, especially if I continue to make mistakes like I did last time. I'm hoping I'm not. I think I'm pretty confident now. I actually didn't know I can build these yet. I thought that was a tier two, a tech two. Hmm. Everybody's getting their tech up. We should get ground tech. How, how expensive is that? It's not that bad. We could go air tech. No, that sucks. We need infantry. We need to get immediately tier 2 infantry. Because tier 1 sucks. Also, Lair Organa. Why don't you join the fleet as this year, fleet's hero? You give a fleet bonus, don't you? Wait, you're general, right? You're general. Yeah, to all units. Perfect. Get over to here. Brilliant. Um, I have 919 left. Let's put that into another X-Wing in this fleet. We're completely broke, but what could I have done with 900 anyway? It does show- let's just- Don't be dumb, don't be dumb, don't be dumb, please. I guess we could always just run. It's not that big of a deal. And if there's nothing here... Oh, it's taking a long time. Oh, it's gonna load up a battle, isn't it? That's so stupid. Okay, thank god. We're going to move a single squad of you over to take this out. And let's combine these two fleets. Immediately. Over here. I don't know why this fleet's over here. That's dumb. And you... Squadron reporting. Give us a peek at what's going on in Eridu, actually. And then this will finally be a proper fleet, because it'll have... Six. Right? No, five. It'll have five Dreadnoughts in it. That's good firepower, plus two capitals. This will become our strongest fleet, shockingly enough. Which I still don't think I should go after Eridu with, because I, I don't know if I have the fighters necessary. I'm going to want a lot of fighters to do that. Um, Admiral, do you have an Admiral? You do have an Admiral. You have this. Yeah, which gives a 10%. This would only give us a 5%. Um, the Hunter. Ooh, could always use another Corvette, plus it's fairly cheap. But I kind of want to save up credits to get the, uh... What do I have on the ground here? I have these. Let's separate you two. And let's pull you guys off the planet. And start having all of you move out to here. Receiving location. Because I'm gonna to want to launch the evasion of Yuko. Yuko. That's not Yuko. Yuko starts with a Y. I don't know what to call you. Oh, I have two tank destroyers. Never mind. On the way. 
That's what your team does, right? You're technically tank destroyers. Yeah. I might. For you, because this is probably your biggest sector here. Because it has all of this here. Which is decent. Which I'm going to want to combine a lot of our ground force here. To create a proper fleet. Because this one... If all of our ground force can fit on a planet, that's a poor ground force. I'm going to want something that I can call reinforcements in if I happen to. Um, get on the ground, please. Thank you. Let's have a looky-loo here. Yeah, this is more like it. This is a fleet. Five of these, two, three of these, three of that. Two X-Wings, decent amount of fighters, not really. We're kind of suffering on fighters still. Two GR-75s. This is good. This is a proper fleet. This is our only proper fleet. Not that it's a bad one. Do you already have manufacturing bases? You don't? Alliance Headquarters. Do I have to get that to get... Army plus, yeah, I do. Wait, can I just put these on everything? Why aren't I doing that? My god, am I dumb? Yeah, just get supply bases everywhere that you can. Because what does it give us? Like, what? 100 plus plus 50? Let's get this stuff. Oh, I don't care, because that's a manufacturing base. Do we have one on Hoth? Nope. Do now. Construction. Alright, in the next one we'll focus on getting the thing, and then in the next paycheck I think we get these guys if properly and reinforced, because we're still recovering from the loss. Especially with Corvettes. I think that was our main problem, was we didn't have Corvettes. So we need to get a couple of Hammerheads ready to go. We need those Hunters. And a couple of... CR90s are good, because they're always good for screening. Um, we're moving all the forces here. Bothla, you can't build me any. No, that's only New Republic. Uh, you. You've already combined this. That's spooky. Getting this early would be good. But I want to get this, because if we take Eridu, we get salt. We get a, we get a Dauntless. See, here's what I'm scared of. Right here. We can take it with fighters. Now, taking the ground. Oh god, look how heavily. Oh my god. Oh, this isn't gonna be a. This is gonna be one of the hardest ground battles. As of yet. This might be one of the hardest ground battles I've done in a long time. Because look at this, we have... We're going to be dealing with multiple ties, so we're going to want some form of anti... We need a... Can you build us a tank factory? Yeah, we need a tank factory here. Most of our already has a tank factory. Can you get us a better tank factory? Yeah, we'll do that in a couple of turns. Um... Hmm... Hmm, hmm, hmm. That's tough. Let's take a poke at Ordabana. This way. Plus, we'll, we'll right as it passes here, we'll pause it when it hits here, if we can manage to get it now. Can we manage to get it while it's no? We didn't manage to get it. Sad. We know nothing about this. Because I think, yeah, maybe Naboo would be a good choice to take with this fleet as a tester fleet. Let's focus on taking this, though, first. So once this is done, which you actually are done, so let's actually move you off planet and get you stationed over here Moving out. while we pull ground forces from you to meet up. Heading out. Uh, I don't think I'm going to pill off of Crate or this planet, because you don't have a lot. Construction complete. 
construction complete of what? Anything over here? What was I constructing? Wait, what was I constructing? No, oh, I was, I was, okay, good. I was constructing a base over here so I can make some more money. And like promised, also didn't escape my thing that we've uh, we've gone down in money somehow. <laughs> can I not build? Do you already have two? You already? Oh, you can't. Oh, interesting. The Empire has an enemy tech upgraded. Enemy tech upgraded. Complete. This would hit. Ooh, that's a good target. That's a really good target. Hey, what do they have here, and can we build anything here? Ground mining facilities. Can I build that? I actually don't know if the Rebel can build a mining facility. That'd be interesting to look into, because I would love to build some mining facilities. Rebel Alliance, what can I build here? Manufacturing base, interesting. Ground tech's about to go up for them. Let's take this money, and let's put it into ground tech. Uh, infiltrators, let's focus on this first. And then we'll have some ground tech, but it's gonna take a minute. And are you useful on Hoth? That's something I wanted to know. Or should I move you to Bespin? 25 health for all non combat support roll. See base income 200. Minus building time, construction time, planetary control. Yeah, okay. Juan Mahathma, come with me. It's a bit dangerous, but we're going to best bend. And it's dangerous because I can't put a lot, I can't really invest heavily in your defense. But you're a major hero. You can be rescued. Let's place you here. They don't really, nobody has raiding units. And we can focus on putting, yeah, and that instantly made everything cheaper here. So I can build uh, that for 900 fairly easily. And that also just upgraded our best bin to over a thousand now. Everything here is plus. We actually don't have any minuses yet. Plus another 500, that's going to put us well over a thousand. That's interesting. That should be enough to put us to 6,000. It should be. I'm hoping it gets done before this, before the week's over. That would be nice. You are not reinforced yet. And then we'll have control of this entire back line, which would be nice. Or platoon, you can build ground mining facilities, yeah you can. And, oh, perfect timing. We literally got 6,000 right as it happened. So we got 6,000 from that. Perfect. Now I look over all my planets and see if I can build anything I don't know about. Andron. Umbara. Ooh. What are you? Useful against sh ships as well as starfighters. Okay. Grab two of those. Can I build Umbar and tanks? No. Um. Hey, Mustafar. Build me one of these. Thank you. We're broke now. That's fine. I need to put the credits in. I see some people playing. I don't know how they managed to get, like, thousands of credits saved up, like, in the first week. I never do that. I always pour all my credits into a a certain thing at a time. Uh, yeah, Chandrilla, that's right. I need to focus on defensive Chandrilla, too. Chandrilla has a tier 1, tier 2 space station already, right? Yeah. Shocked that this hasn't been taken yet. Production. Let's take her Gander. Do I have any... This planet. Rakamarin. What did you give me? You have a tactical of 1... Is that how much you give us? Do you give us one? How do I tell? Do I just hover over you? That isn't what I wanted. Chantrilla gave us- yeah, that's how you tell. That's actually how you tell how much PopCap gives you, doesn't it? That only gives me 
one. Hoth gives me one. What? Navarro gives me three. Mosfar gives me three. Three. Okay. Solo's fan gives me five. Crate. 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 Gives me one. Okay. Now what about the plants I'm trying to attack here? What does Scarif give me? One. Rathana. Three. And what about this plant? 25. Because this is an agricultural world. I'll take this. It's still not going to be enough. I'll build a pop cap center to make up for it. And then I retreat off this. I guess retreating would only mean selling this. But I just don't want this. Too bad I can't sell the space stations. I might actually leave it all there. Why would I retreat? There's nothing there. I'll just leave everything there. And then I'll just be like our fallback point. Not a fallback point. <laughs> Ignore me. I'm talking out of my butt here for a second. Not my fallback point, but that will just be like making us money. Because that is all it's doing right now. Or it's not costing us anything. It's plus 179, so I'll just make us some credits. Hey, Bothwa. Do you mind? No. Yeah, you can't do that yet. You are Alliance Intelligence Center. Okay. Also, you are a stealth tech. Infantry commander. Are you stealth tech? No, you're not. You are stealth tech. You are stealth. I'm gonna wanna get some more of those. Okay. Gearing up for this, they're about to have more ground production offline. We don't have enough money to do anything. Hmm. <laughs> so which of these... I guess I have to do this one because I'm not ready for this other one. Do you have all your forces? You do. You don't have a lot of anti-infantry. Let's hit the deck with the militia commando. Because these guys can handle pretty much anything. Do I actually have bombers in there? I, ha I have a bomber squadron, don't I? I'll look really quick before I get this battle started. If I have a bomber squadron. That would be nice, just to be able to do bomber hunts. I actually do, funny enough. So I'll be able to do, because you'll be able to do bombardments, and you'll be able to do bombing runs. Just this one unit alone will give me a bombing run. Perfect. All right, let's get this battle started. Ooh, interesting. They're shooting at us. Hold on. Help him. Actually, out. capture this. Yes, sir. Sir? Capture right this. Yes. I can do that. Capturing anything here would be pretty much useless. But this is a big deal because this can shoot. This can shoot stuff at them without them being able to as they're coming across here. Plus whatever defenses we're able to build here. This is a good this is easy to defend. They have not put enough on to this, target. thank god. Affirmative. Drop Transmission down. Received. Drop down. We've secured a build pad. Give me this. Heading out, sir. Grab me this. Are what you are you going, concerned? Sir? Rangers? Ranger platoons. Let's pause for a minute. Does that mean... Or horn ambush waiting for long range? Yeah, okay. These are snipers. Perfect. Bring these guys in. We'll bring these guys in as well, and we'll bring in an anti-tank girl, just in case. Hoof, they're all here. Everybody's here. How are you actually managing it? Hold out, please. We actually have no money, funny enough. Ready, so be it. I'll follow your lead. Be ready? Don't auto do that. This does rally, increases fire rate and defense. Interesting. This gives us saber throw. You are militia task force. You are militia total soldier team. So you are the militia task force that comes down with him. Elite infantry. You are also trained infantry. So this is elite. This is class trained infantry. So these guys fall into the same, but these are elites. That's good. What do you see? get up here too. Your max range is helping us a lot here. 
ready to help. I don't know how you're alive still. Everybody, what is it? go here to capture right this you. really quickly. I know we're still bringing in infantry and stuff. A blind man and a fool. A blind man the and a fool against the empire. So be it. Just hold out here so we can drop you in and maybe get attack. some of that if we ever do. <laughs> okay. Hover tank ready. Two. Move out. Oh, that's bad. Flat cannon turret. No, it's not. It just means we don't get bombing guns. I was worried that was a turbo laser. Actually, move out here and help support. Like you, rush out to help support. Group one. Honestly, yeah, move out. We have very speedy vehicles, so this is a blitz run. Let's just hit these guys as fast as possible. Okay, these guys are being taken out immediately by your snipers. That's good. Immediately focus fire under that. Hey, maybe don't do that. Maybe don't do that. Maybe hold out. Please, God. <laughs> And you guys move up. But start to crash down. In group 2, actually group 3. Engage that, because that can actually hurt this tank group. A blind man and a fool. Move against this flank. Move against this. And this is destroyed. Move against this. Rockets are super effective and destroyed. Engage this. Give us a good old rally. Did you actually? That was that was kind of adorable. And toss that whenever you can. Fuck that killed a good chunk of them. Group three, engage this. I actually have the capabilities of doing so, and I don't want them eating our infantry anymore. Focus fire under this. Perfect, perfect. Having this group of infantry- I actually want you go and support this. Move out and support that. Hey, group two. Fall back, fall back, fall back, fall back. Get over to here immediately. And engage. Yeesh, don't tank the heads. There you go. Can he actually shoot while he's in that state? I don't think he can. Funny enough. Yeah, I'm come out of that and rush up. We can't really do anything about this, so group 3, move out. You're fast enough to be able to recover quickly. Group 2, do the same. Take out the only tanks that they have. Take out this. And group 2, take out this. Group 1. Fall onto this. And we're actually being able to take this out now. Focus fire under this. Good thing we have rocket teams. Also, do that, please. <laughs> Take out these guys, which you can do fairly easily. Funk. That just took out almost the entire squad. But focus on this, please. How are you holding? Excellent. Take group three. Hit the rear. Group 2, don't just engage, don't blindly engage. Try hitting the rear, because these guys are going to be pretty much see? occupied with us. Take Blast these guys out. Scum. Is there just somebody, who just did that? Oh my god. This guy has the, like, the big repeating blaster from the phone. Like, that's so cool. Yeah, this is really, 
the perfect group, honestly, for this. This is an excellent battle. This is going excellently. Take a couple of screenshots, please. There you go. Thank you. That's a... Uh, ooh, that's good. Take a screenshot of that. Okay. Just gather our screenshots. <laughs> Perfect. And actually move up. What is it? And group one. Engage. And actually uncover. Only for you guys, because we'll save your rockets in case we need them for any reason. Excellent. Move out. Hold out here, group 3, hold out here. Group 1, just move up the middle. I wish the heroes weren't faster than everything else. Or that they were, and then they just stuck with the group, like the tanks do. If I move these tanks together, these guys wouldn't just rush up ahead. They would actually move as a unit. I have to go through you, so be it. Oh, wait a minute. They don't have anything else. I was like, alright, we should get ready for their next attack. They don't have another wave, because they don't have anything. The most they're going to get is a couple of army troopers. Yeah, this is all they have. They have a couple of barracks. Engage. And... Kadoosh, kadoosh. This might take this. Honestly, this my barrage might take them out. Really close. Yeah, it's done. What? What do they have? A little sad we didn't get any credits from destroying units, but whatever. I thought we got credits for that, but I guess not. By the way, this hunt ability is really cool because this makes them search. Oh, this might be it. Ooh, this is getting wrecked. If this is the last unit, that, that'll be it. Come on, don't let it get away. It is not, so began hunting again. That hunt ability allows them to just patrol and look for units. Which I think is really cool. And as you can see, they're all like splitting up. This would be an excellent spot to defend. <laughs> Having these things, having your tanks here, then having like a group number here, plus this, plus these two. If you can rush over here quickly enough to grab that. Ooh. Yeah, what am I doing? They're probably all here. <laughs> Just start doing stuff to them. I know you're not really built for this, but you can still deal damage to them. And... Perfect. Grenades are out. Lots of grenades are out. Oh, they're trying to run. That's hilarious. You know what I have to say to that? This might be overkill. I have this to say about that. Let's actually pull back because I want these guys at the bottom of them to actually be effective. I love the idea of... I just want... I'm pulling them back for the pure units. I know they're going to try and retreat. Oh. Let's see the bombs. Oh, everything's like Oh, there we go. Let's follow this they're in from the bomber's back. perspective. Oh, they're trying to fall back. And... Was not quick enough. They still have units. That's sad. Also, I learned that the AI cheats and that they... Uh, somebody commented in the last video. They can retreat even if they're not on a build pad, which I think is lame. Because... As if the player faction, if you're not on the build, the retreat pad, when you push retreat and the timer goes up, you lose all the units that you didn't retreat with. That's so lame. <laughs> we didn't lose a single thing in that, and that was a decently sized garrison. That's pretty good. That's really good. That makes me feel infinitely better about that space battle from the last time. All right. I'm going to have the ground units fall back to Rish, just in case. 
Also, do you have a fighter? I guess you're blind, so that wouldn't make much sense. Alright, that went really well. And we have another planet on our hold, another uh, agricultural world, fine enough. We're going to now take Scarif, which opens us up to this, which is interesting. I don't know if I want to do that yet. The Empire it has might be a wise level. idea to get capital ship shipyard over here and to get at least another sh capital shipyard in here before I do that. Also, let's take a look over here, because I know I was building... I was building stuff for this, right? No, I wasn't, because I broke. I wasn't doing any of that sort. That requires money. I know I, I built some stuff over here, so let's ship this thing over here. This would give us five squadrons of uh, X-Wings. Pretty good. Um, this is done now. That's good. Corruption. Stop it. Joke's on you, I have a unit that whenever I have money, I can get rid of this. Is this just Blacks and Presents? Yeah. Which I don't like, because that means if they corrupt this, they can just attack a backline world. I think that's how that works. It might not be, but I think there's some unit that they'll just, they'll bribe their way past it and they could attack any of these undefended backline worlds. Which is fun when you're playing as the as the people taking that over, but it's not so fun when you're playing as the other people. Um, I think I'm gonna leave this one here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe. If you want to see more content like this, you can check out my playlist I have and my other Empire War playlists. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!